here, or if you follow me from YouTube, it's Dayweird1993 Vlogs. Welcome back to our stream. As you may have noticed, we've made some small upgrades again to our interface. Uh, the work of a graphic designer is never done, and now I've started changing things, I'm probably never going to stop because I keep upgrading little, bit, little bits. So now you'll be able to see... Um, that we've upgraded the way that our interface looks just to make it a bit cleaner. Um, as we move forward, of course, things might get tweaked just based on feedback. Ah, you're streaming on Discord. Nice one, man. Nice one. Um, let's have a look here. Is anyone actually online in Guild? Yeah, yeah people, well, there, there were people online in Guild. Is there anybody online now or is it just me? Oh, there's people online. Uh, oh, you're about, about to str stream it on Discord. Nice, man. Nice, nice. You having fun? Are you having fun streaming it? Yeah, well, because I thought we might actually die here. Hello now. Yeah, I thought I might actually die there somehow. I keep forgetting I'm I am not a plate wearer anymore. I, I'm playing a caster, and I need to stop running in and just expecting to survive every encounter like that. I'm a warlock, and I need to stand at a distance. I am an idiot. I do apologize. Why am I apologizing for being, a dumb, what, being an idiot? I'm just, I should be proud of being a goddamn dumbass. for some dungeons, because God knows that's more lucrative. Where's my voidy boy? I, I, what I like about a void walker is basically what I'm asking it to do is... But hey there, hey there everybody, I'm asking you to... Basically what you do... Oh, you haven't started yet, cool. Um, the thing is, with... Um, with a void walker what i find is you're literally asking hey creature from beyond the veil um do you mind if you just come and be a punch bag for me like you know basically i'm it's like yeah, yeah i'm summoning you so that someone can punch you instead of me be good i imagine it's like what being a manager feels like But I'll just get one of my colleagues to look into that for you, knowing full well that they're going to get yelled at. Just having a look at the stream. Yeah, you're not missing anything important looking at that. Just making sure that the new graphic doesn't interfere with how the stream looks. Um, because of course that would have been bad. Just making sure we're central, because I know it was slightly off there and it was bothering me. Yeah, we're good. That's the only thing when I've been tweaking the interface, certain things get moved. Uh, and I, and I, yeah, it's one of those things where I, um, I like to double check. Yeah, exactly. So I, um, need to save some pilots. That's what we're doing here. So it has to be streamed in a server. Oh, I see. Now I get what you mean. See, I'm on a. See, with WoW, I suppose with stream, I suppose it's different to how 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 Twitch streaming works. So I stream, obviously from my account, and I'm on a server. Never streamed using Discord before, so I wouldn't know how that works. God, it takes ages to revive him. 
We've seen some new customization reveals for the humans in Shadowlands in the data mining, which has been pretty cool. Nah. Wait, wait, wait. Um, keep forgetting I've got flying for Pandaria. So I invited you to a server, me and my friends are in when it's just... Oh, I see. Cool. Yeah, I'll have to check that out. As I say, um, my Discord doesn't automatically log me on. I need to all sort out my Discord. I've had some problems with it on this computer. I think it's just that I've not got it configured properly, but I don't use it very often. Um, but I managed to get in and add you, but I can't really do much with it right now, but I'll, I'll work it out. Um, that's something I'll do when, when I'm off the air. Um, like, it lets me add you. and the, But it's like, in terms of functionality, my Discord's like a little bit stupid. Uh, I don't really know why. Um, I, 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 would pro, I would prefer to have a Discord, because it's much easier to do so. I mean, I'll look into I'll have a good look into it. I've got time. I won't be, I won't be working from home for like another week at least, so I've got time to look, in, look into it. What else do we need? So we need some Apple Bloom Cinder, and we need to save some pilots. Come on, man, you're gonna live. So I, I'm sure I'll be able to get my Discord working. Um, I just need to look into it. It might just be me being dumb and I've just set something up wrong. Um, I, I, I very rarely um, use it, so as a result of that, I kind of um, don't know what I'm looking at, really, with Discord. I mean, I know it's just a voice chat hosting thing. Hang on a second, my World of Warcraft's been funny. I've had to restart my WoW, uh, just because... Uh, you had a bit of a software glitch there. It kept, um, it just wasn't responding. Um, it was a bit slow. Like my reactions were delayed, but it wasn't lagged because my latency was fine. bit of technical difficulties. Ah, there we go. That was annoying, but we're back. There's also no enemies around here, which is suspicious. Game capture working on your side? Yeah, looks like it is. Cool. Just testing the stream very quickly. Yeah, it's fine. Looks like we got Shadow Pan Monastery as our first dungeon today. Cool. I have a plan. I need to 
target to convert. Oh yeah, because they're like, oh yeah, it's Shadow Pan, it's where they train the monks. Like, the, uh, the the Shadow Pan monks, which are like the elite, I suppose like the uh, the elite fighting force in Pandaria. I'm sure there's a mechanic here about this. I'm sure there's a mechanic involved with this. Where I've got Esther shouting me now, but she knows I'm doing something, so... Dungeons here were so aesthetically pleasing, like, they were just so good to look at. Just keeping one earphone off just in case I get summoned by my daughter. Funny enough, the first time she's, she's, the first time today she decided that she wants me to do anything rather than saying no, Dada, uh, is when I've gone to do streaming. Kids. Um. Serpent. Oh, yeah, someone's. Yeah, that's kids for you, man. Yeah, definitely. Um, but the thing is, she's been like, no, Dada, go away. Or, or, you know, doing their own thing. And then as soon as I go and do streaming, da, 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 it's like. You know, it's like. It's like, it's a good job you're really cute. We got a DPS down the serpent, guys. Come on. If you don't kill the serpent, it's gonna kill you. Oh, well, I'm glad that these guys have a brain cell to rub together. I hate it when you've got a, um... When you get a dungeon group and they're all idiots, I hate it. I just want to have a quick look at something. I'm just very aware that when we unlock the Dark Iron Dwarf Heritage Armor, um, it's going to be interesting because I want to, obviously I know it's plate and I'm a cloth wearer, but I'd like to incorporate the shoulders into a transmog for a warlock. I think it'd look really cool. And I'm just working out what I'm going to do with that. There's plenty. If 
I remember rightly, you used to have to mount up here. I hate that so much. So yeah, we're constantly making improvements to the stream in terms of how it looks. Um, it's going to be something that takes some iteration. But I'm finally getting to the point where I look at my stream interface and I'm quite happy with how this all looks right now. Yeah? Okay. It appears that Esther has invaded the room. <laughs> Oh yeah, I remember this is the fight where you got to fight the monks and then you fight Snowdrift in the dojo part and he summons like mirror images of himself. God, it's been a long time since I did this dungeon. I think the last time I probably did this was when it was current content. Wise words. <laughs> yeah, because he summons the channeling versions of himself either side of the room. Yeah, because he multiplies. I actually thought, like, a lot of people didn't like Pandaria, but I actually really liked this expansion. I thought they did a really good job of integrating interesting and deep lore around something that could have theoretically been, you know, like, a silly idea. I, I don't think the Panda Pandaran were a silly idea, to be honest. It's like, why, why not? Hi, Esther. So the Pandaren, they, um, from a lore perspective, I really like how um, their culture is centered around they liberated themselves from slavery, um, or from the Mogu, uh, 
the Atalans fight without weapons, and in a way, their law kind of mirrors the um, the orcs, in that they were enslaved by one means or another, and due to the way they were enslaved, um, that is kind of altered now, so that they they're, they're not, but obviously they freed themselves, whereas the orcs, you know, they had to break free of their demonic corruption. Um, so it's, I suppose theoretically, their law almost has some parallels with the orc law, which is what, what I sure thought was an interesting parallel because people said they didn't like the Pandaren law might it's very similar to Orcish law theoretically so what is the problem in terms of like the basic story beats of people who ended up enslaved Do you want something to do knee? Yeah. Come here then. Me. Quick. Whoa. Hello. Hello. Say hi everybody. Hi everybody. Careful. Hi. Don't be sorry, just be careful. Wow. Wow. What are you looking at? That's a mouse map. Look, is that a friend? Yeah. Yeah, that's a friend. Yeah, Dada with friends. Yeah, Dada. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? No, no, no. You've been a good girl for mommy. <laughs> That's an arrow, uh, target. Huh? Too far away. It's a movie. It's a map. Yeah, map. Yeah. I need to target something first. Do you magic? Oh no. Careful, don't touch that fella, she's using that, darling. You're cheeky. That's the ruby. Esther, stop it. Stop. Don't do that. Don't do that, Esther. Just a moment, guys. Well, guys, sorry about that. Just uh, Esther decided she was going to um, she was going to abscond the stream, and then now she decided she wants to go back downstairs to mom. We've got to a point where basically what we have to do is we have to lie to her and say that if she uh, 
messes around on the stairs, her head will fall off, which, I mean, I suppose it's not entirely incorrect, because she could break her neck, but, you know, we'd rather that not happen. So we're fighting the Shah of Violence now. Oh, crap. Oh, we lost the DPS. What a shame. Oh, the healer disconnected. That's fun. Chris all well. I'm taking a soul stone. <laughs> oh, someone's got the disguise thing, haven't they? Yeah, we're gonna have to boat kick the healer, sadly. Let's go. Yeah. I like how it just turns you into a boss that, that time. So that's a toy I want to collect, actually, because I can you can transform into so many different forms. But I, uh, please wait, Zatera. Says. That's 
Better? Oh yeah, because Taran Zhu has been corrupted in the storyline by the Shah of Hatred. Well, we, oh yeah, gripping hatred, that's, target that, get that down. Put our dot up, couple of casts of immolate, then we'll throw some chaos bolts. Why throw hands when you can throw chaos bolts? That's good. Just gonna cut this part down for YouTube real quick.